From World of Concrete 2019, I'd like you to now meet John Comrie, who's a product specialist with Volvo. Hi. How are you, sir? Hi, Roger. Nice I'm to fine. meet you. Nice to meet you as well. Excellent. Welcome well, you to brought Vegas. two new machines to this show. We did, you yeah. Yeah, you guys are lucky. We are, why yeah. are we lucky? Because this is the launch of our ECR18E, yeah. which is a ultra short swing radius machine. So okay. that means we've got less than half an inch. It's a base. It's a base, yeah. So when it's over the tracks, there's less than half an inch sticking over the tracks. Wow, track, yeah. wow. We actually have two machines. We only have one here, the ECR18, um, the, uh, which is a short radius, and we have an EC20, which is a conventional radius. Uh, two different models. One is designed more for maybe the rental company and uh, landscapers. Yeah. And then the EC20 would be for someone who needed maybe a little bit more lift capacity with a conventional frame. What did Volvo think about the idea of bringing these two machines online? What was the reason for it this time around? Well, it, it was time to update our old, old models, oh, right? Okay. And what we do is we have these clinics and we listen to the voice of the customer. And I can tell you on these two models, when I take this, this machine back to an, an existing customer, right. he's going to shake my hand. We listen to the voice of the customer and we, 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 we upgrade it. We change a lot of the uh, functions to make them very operator friendly because operators know the machine better than me. Yeah, the guys have to sit there eight they're, hours they're, a day. They're, they're and every just, day. Yeah. And so we listen to what they said and I think these two machines, right. they're definitely, we, we definitely listen now, to the customer. Did you increase lift capacity or any of that? On the EC20, we list lift capacity increased by 20%. Wow. Yeah. That's quite a stretch. Yeah. The ECR18, this is a brand new model for us. We've never had a short radius under two ton. Um, the lift capacity is uh, uh, two feet six out. It's run about 1,300 pounds with the blade down. So for that size machine, it's excellent lift capacity on it. Well, that machine is probably more for what, like a landscaper or some of that? That landscaper, rental. Yeah, yeah, like rental that. market. You know, Somebody doesn't mind market. sitting out in the cold and the wet. You know, right, right. Because the 18 uh, comes only with a ROPS canopy. The ECR20, uh, sorry, the EC20 has the option of a full cab and heat. So a little bit more comfort, a little bit more expense, you know. No, speaking of comfort, you bring operator comfort up to grade with these machines? Ab absolutely. Too? We change the hydraulic system on ah. them. We fine tuned the hydraulics. Uh, so if you're using like a grading bucket, it's uh, proportional hydraulics, pilot control. Yes. Great feedback through the, the joysticks. We we change the, 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 the arm rests that are incorporated in the joystick turret. So you have a really good fit, really good feel. And it makes it over a longer period, you don't get tired, you know, you don't yeah. get stiff yeah. arms. Right, you right. Know? Yeah, we change it a lot. One of the things as well, we have a, a ISO pattern change valve to go from backhoe to excavator. And I used to get a call all the time, where's the, where's that valve, where's the valve? So listen to the customer, and now right next to the operator, we have a great big red switch with a picture of an excavator and a backhoe, bright red, so you can see it easily. Just flip the switch and away you go. Listen to the customers. You know? Yeah, yeah, exactly right. Well, tell me about uh, some of the things here about uh, the unique feature of the machine. It, 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 it's, uh, well, it's features a, and improvements, improvements in the way uh, of tracking or anything of that design? Well, yeah, we, we, uh, we completely redesigned this machine from ground up. It has a variable undercarriage, so ah. hydraulically you can adjust That's it. That's what I was trying to find. Yeah, I knew, I knew. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you can adjust the track from five foot three Okay. All the way into three foot three inches. Oh my goodness! And that's done uh, through uh, the, the, the dozer blade hydraulic system. So the operator can actually adjust it if he wants to go through a narrow door or something. Shrink it or something. He can do that. And uh, the dozer blade, or the cleanup blade, whatever you want to call it, it has these gull wings on it, so you can fold them in as well. So if you bring the tracks in, you need to bring the blade in as well. Absolutely. And you don't need any wrenches or tools to do it. Unique. Yeah. Very unique. And anyway, when we designed the frame, when we went to the, the, uh, the short radius, we made the, the, uh, the counterweight three-piece. And it sits up a little bit higher. And the idea is that if it gives you good stability, right? It gives you a bit good balance. But also, if you have to get inside to work or, or take the engine out, you can take one of these three pieces off. You don't have to take the whole counterweight off. You can actually get to the components. Wow. Another uh, neat feature we have is when you open the door, Accessibility is important, right, for your maintenance Absolutely. service. Yeah. So when you open the door, the actual fuel tank is inside the door, or the hood, whatever you want to call it, right? Yeah. 
uh, so that gives you great accessibility to your filters, to your hydraulic pump, to your fil uh, fuel filters. So for, for servicing, it makes it really, really yeah. much better. Yeah. yeah. And quicker. And quicker. And then we also changed our cooling package. Previously, we had a cooler with a, a fold-out hydraulic cooler in front of the engine cooler. So that always restricts the, the air. Sure does. So what we've done now is we made a side-by-side -side cooling system. So the hydraulics oh. and the engine get the same flow of air, right? So it's the same temperature. So it cools much better, more efficient. Absolutely. Well, I sure want to appreciate you stopping by and bringing your message That's with us. And great to be here. Tell us about now. You got the new machine at the show. First time ever. First time seen in North America. What? In fact, first time seen in the world, I think. Really? Yes. Okay. So major day, right? Major day. So, thank you very thanks, much, Roger. John Comrie, who's a product specialist with Volvo Construction Equipment, and you heard about it right here, World of Concrete 2019.